Many Bay Area voters who woke up early to cast their ballot on the very first day of early voting were met with long lines, some waiting up to an hour to vote. It was all the way over here to the um, end of the street, okay, and wrapped around the building. That's how far it was. That did not deter some. In fact, it excited them to see the amount of people who showed up. Because it means people are interested in what's going on in our country. And usually when I come to vote, it's empty and nobody's here. And so it's great to see so many people here. Concerned about mail and ballots brought some people to the polls today. Others believe it's the most important election in their lifetime. I know a lot of people think that their vote doesn't matter, but if a million people say that their vote doesn't matter, that's a million votes that don't get don't get used. And a lot of people have fought hard for our right to vote, and I think it's important that we honor that legacy. As long as you're registered to vote in Hillsborough County, you can vote early at any of the 26 early voting sites. This year, there are two new locations, Raymond James Stadium and Amelie Arena. It was very easy. Everybody was respectful. They maintained their distance. Everybody had masks on. It went very smooth inside, very efficient. Given the pandemic, voters are facing unique circumstances. We're wiping down the inside of these areas, all the privacy booths, the counter spaces. <clears throat> At last check, there were 15,000 votes cast today. As I mentioned, there are 26 uh, locations in Hillsborough County where you can early vote. We have a link on our website, abcactionnews.com, for all of those locations. You have until November 1st to cast your early vote. Reporting in Tampa, I'm Rebecca Petit, ABC Action News.